subscribe and press the bell icon so you never miss an update from PWIP. Export knowledge be, trade be. Hi friends, let's talk about drying of paddy. In this, we normally come across single dry and double drying of paddy. What is this double drying of paddy? Why is it used? Where it happens? In which regions and which price varieties it happens? Is something that we will try and understand in this video, my friends. Very quickly, just to give you a background of how paddy procurement and what happens during the uh, procurement of paddy, is that बहुत सारे किसानों से, बहुत सारे field खेतों से paddy when it comes, somebody has a moisture uh, in the paddy which is 20%. किसी का पैड़ी में 24% है, किसी का पैड़ी में 18% है, based on जब उन्होंने हार्वेस्ट किया था, क्या टेम्परेचर, क्या वाटर कंडीशंस थे, ये सब फैक्टर्स वेरी हो सकते हैं। तो जब ये सब पैड़ी, when it all comes to a mill, the paddy will be having different moisture levels. तो first thing which is very important is all the paddy has to be bought to a single moisture, a same common moisture level. नहीं तो क्या होगा कि वैसे ही अगर आप मिल करोगे तो वो सम राइस विल लुक वेरी वाइट सम विल लुक डार्क सम विल लुक अ डिफरेंट कलर सो व्हेन यू पुट ऑल द राइस टुगेदर इट विल लुक वेरी इट विल नॉट लुक यूनिफॉर्म इन इट्स फिनिश इसलिए ड्राइंग किया जाता है बट देन मिलिंग करने के लिए भी द द यू नो द पैडी इफ इट इज 20% मॉइस्चर वो मिलिंग भी नहीं कर सकते क्योंकि द मॉइस्चर कंटेंट इज टू हाई आइडियली 14% इज द मॉइस्चर लेवल हर कोई चावल में एक्चुअली देखना चाहता है बट देन ये डबल ड्राइंग जो है ये कम से कम 12% मॉइस्चर टू 13% मॉइस्चर के लेवल में होना चाहिए नाउ व्हाई इज दैट हु डज इट अभी for example, if you're talking about uh, swarna rice, if you're talking about any other rice like gobindabog or basmati, bahut sare chawal mein double drying ka concept nahi hota hai. But specifically, if you come to regions like Raichur in Karnataka, Tumkur in Karnataka, Sirigupa, Sindhanur, Gangavati in Karnataka, where a good quality of sona masuri rice is milled, yaha pe ye double drying wala jo concept hai, wo zyada dek dekhi jati hai. Primarily, export me or even domestic me, if we want the rice to look good, good and whiter in steam, majorly this happens in steam. If you want the rice to look much creamier and whiter, that is when double drying is preferred. And double drying, my friends, is very an expensive process. मतलब कोई कोई पैड़ी को डबल ड्राइंग के लिए बहुत पावर लगता है इलेक्ट्रिसिटी लग, लगता है एंड दैट दैट इज व्हाई इट मेक्स इट मोर एक्सपेंसिव एट द सेम टाइम जब आप डबल ड्राई करोगे तो बहुत सारे जो वीक ग्रेन्स होते हैं वो टूट जाते हैं तो मिलर को ये इसका कॉस्ट कवर करना होता है दैट इज व्हाई डबल ड्राइंग इज एन एक्सपेंसिव प्रोसेस बट इट इज वेरी गुड फॉर द ग्रेन बिकॉज इट लुक्स गुड द ग्रेन लुक्स गुड एंड लोग इसीलिए भी ये करते हैं इफ देर इज अ न्यू हार्वेस्ट ऑफ अ पैडी एंड देन दे वॉन्ट टू ब्रिंग इन द न्यू क्रॉप इन टू द मार्केट फास्टर तो उसको ज्यादा ड्राई करना पड़ता है बट देन द ओनली थिंग माई फ्रेंड्स दैट योर डिपेंड्स इन दिस इज दैट हर क्या हर कोई ग्रेन डबल ड्राइंग सहने की जो स्ट्रेंथ uh, जो ग्रेन स्ट्रेंथ होना चाहिए that that is very very important not all grains can go through a double drying thing because the grains will break and if it leads to a lot of brokens then again the millers have problems because it will lead to losses right so this is what i will quickly give you an example my friends it is not also that the grain has to be a premium good rice for example if you go to mirial guda in telangana a lot of Sona, BPT, RNR, HMT and Kolam rice is milled. But then in Miryal Guda region, in all of this region, normally these millers are used to doing single drying of paddy. As you know the BPT 5204, RNR, HMT, Kolam are very good grains. right? Even then they don't do double drying because the markets that they sell to are all okay with uh, single drying uh, rice, single dried rice, single dried paddy, single dried rice always looks a bit creamier and a bit yellowish. Why? Because it is dried sing uh, single once 
and the moisture is higher than a double dry paddy so it will always look yellow but that doesn't mean that if it looks looking yellow it is a uh, lower it looks like a lower quality no because customers also have preferences for example tamil nadu as a market is very used to having a colored yellow cream yellow or creamy colored rice bangalore as a market singapore as a market is used to buying rice a little bit whiter but better sri lanka as a market is used to buying rice which is creamy in color so based on the markets this color is also decided so my friends mirial guda is used to this so they do single drying it's not that the millers cannot cannot do this it's based on the market preferences also mills in this karnataka region who do sona masuri rnr varieties are supplying to tamil nadu as well as bangalore and mumbai and gujarat markets where big based on the markets that's how they mill it but for our understanding double dried and single dried this is the concept my my friends not all grains have it in them to be double dried it's only a few grains which can take that uh, double drying because it's a lot of pressure on the grains as well they should not break so this is one concept of double drying i hope my friends you have liked this content and this information that we just discussed please help us understand what else is what you need to understand in the rice or the export business and you can leave them on the comment section so that i can come back with a video uh, you know for you as soon as possible until then thank you Thank <laughs> you.